And with me in studio now is Mr. Tom Djokovic. He is the CEO of XNX Incorporated. XSNX is their stock symbol. Tom, always good to see you. It's great to be back, Tom. Thanks. You know, the last time we had you on, it was pretty exciting because you showed us photographs of your uh, setup now that mm -hmm. you're already basically in the process of being able to invite potential manufacturers and potential licensees of your SIG solar technology in. How's the progress on that coming now? Well, we're getting close to on the systems uh, assembled and we've been doing what's called calibration. We're getting excellent results. One of the biggest things is challenge the co-evaporation for SIGs is being able to get enough heat energy to convert a solid metal into a pure gas where it's literally atom by atom gas. And we're our, so far the testing has shown that that's what our sources are doing. So we're very excited. That's a, that's a major hurdle that some companies never Never overcame and ultimately went defunct as, as a result of. So uh, we're very excited about those results. We're making great progress. We're getting closer every day. You know, every time you come in and you tell me about the, the technology and what you're trying to accomplish, I expect that you would be in a white lab coat. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> but uh, now, we've talked about this before when it comes down to solar power. The manufacturers are looking for ways to create the solar cells cheaper and cheaper and mm -hmm. cheaper. And you really feel the SIG solar technology that you folks have is the answer. Well, absolutely, Don. We, we really do. We think we're really onto something here. We're also, in a sense, like a last man standing in the SIGs area. A lot of companies put a lot of money, and I mean a lot of money, a lot more than we have, into some now, you know, defunct type of, of pro programs. And uh, we're taking this uh, this approach, more of a bootstrap approach, but our technology, this small area of individual processing is very exciting. And, we, you know, we publish newsletters and uh, to our, primarily our shareholders, but apparently it has a very wide audience. And there's a lot of potential customers of ours around the globe that see these newsletters and they've been contacting us recently because there's a revival in the solar space mm -hmm. in, in Europe going on. We're seeing in terms of confidence, we're seeing a lot of uh, manufacturers contacting us now. They're interested in starting small 10, 15 megawatt type of platform. We're the only company that could potentially uh, deliver something like that. And uh, and they're looking to leverage uh, local incentives. They're not afraid of the Chinese as much anymore because a lot of tariffs are going in place. China's starting to develop more internal demand for their product to c consume what they have. So there's seeing uh, business opportunities here and we're getting these phone calls and it's very 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 exciting for us to see an increase in the number of potential customers. Would it be safe to say that sometime in first quarter 2013 that you'll start hosting some of these manufacturers to come in and see this at this 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 tool uh, in operation and the calibration will be completed by then do you suppose? First quarter, I would say yes. I would go. F this is this is this is a, a breaking news here on yes, TV because we haven't really identified because the bring the bringing up of the tool process involves a calibration where you meter everything and then uh, then you use all that knowledge based on how how well the sources work, how fast they deposit, the temperatures are required to develop a recipe. Then you start producing SIGs. Then you dial in even more. But quite frankly, you never finish dialing. Right. Every solar manufacturer on the planet is continuously turning knobs, regardless of technology. It's the same process here. So we're essentially bringing a race car out of the garage. We're taking it for laps on the track, and we're figuring out exactly what we have to do. And and within the first quarter, I would say absolutely yes. We feel confident we'll be there. Uh, hopefully, well within the first quarter. Hopefully in the near future, because things are, have progressed quite well, and we hope that each success builds on the next here. So so we're very excited. You know, once you get the calibration. Uh, to a point that you're happy with it. I'd love to get some video of the apparatus in operation. Uh, that'd be really great to have on the program. You can count on it. You can count on it. The company is XNX. The stock symbol is XSNX. Uh, again, uh, Tom, thanks so much. Thanks for having me, Don.